Hello again. Uh, I have a shed which I've made into kind of a sci-fi theme and um, I was uh, looking for some uh, you know, extra bits for it and I, and I saw these online and these, these cost me £40. And these are speakers from the Philips Streamium MCI 900. Uh, now that uh, retailed you know, as a total system for about £900. I thought well, they can't be that bad. Um, I, see, I looked online and I found a couple of views and one said they were fantastic, the treble sparkled and um, one I remember from what Hi-Fi said they were a bit near. So I thought well I'll, I'll buy them and see what they're like and they're, they're only £40 and I quite like them because I say they, they look a bit like Daleks. So if you look a bit, bit closer then what you can see is you've got the, the treble unit is on this sort of spike here. Uh, now you've got to be careful not to sort of use that as a handle because uh, the, the things like to break and they are they are fairly hefty. The uh, mid-range woofer is here. It's about a five-inch uh, woofer, and apparently all this helps uh, you know reduce standing waves or something. If you look at it on the side, it looks like it's kind of tilted forward. The idea is that these these both come forward at you, I believe. And around the back, you've got a small uh, reflex port and some binding posts, which uh, I've tried to get these uh, things out in the middle. I don't think they come, so I don't think these take banana uh, plugs. I think they're just standard wires. So, I've wired them up and I thought, well, let's, let's see how they sound. And I'm afraid of the two reviews, I'm, I'm going to go for the Watt Hi-Fi. I thought that they sounded a bit nah, really. Um, there wasn't much definition. I thought that the mid-range was was quite congested. I didn't get the sparkly treble, and overall, I, I was I was really quite disappointed with them. And given that these cost only ten pound less than the Q Acoustics 3010s I bought, and frankly, the difference between them is is night and day. Uh, the Q Acoustics are, are way ahead of these. The other thing is that these are possibly the worst packed uh, speakers I've got from eBay. They were kind of just lumped in a box. So overall, as, as far as the Philips go, well, they look like Daleks. And, and well, frankly, I've, I've, I'm not going to say they sound like Daleks, but, uh, but they, no, I, was, uh, I was quite, uh, quite disappointed with these. So um, I'm not sure I'm going to be using them much at all. Uh, so that, that's all I can say about them, really. I'm sorry I bought them. I, I, I can't recommend anyone anyone else buy them unless unless they want to look at an odd design. Anyway, so uh, hopefully I'll, I'll find something more enjoyable to talk about next time. Thanks for watching.